Peace to everyone. Um, this is about Bow Wow wants no parts of Andrea Kelly, accuses her of lying on R. Kelly. Now, I don't understand why Bow Wow would accuse Andrea Kelly of lying on her ex-husband. He was not there, first of all, so he don't know what the heck happened during that time they were married. He wasn't even there. So now he's accusing of Andrea Kelly of lying on her ex-husband? Really? I mean, I remember Bow Wow when he was a little boy. He was called Little Bow Wow. But now he's grown and he's accusing of Andrea Kelly of lying on our Kelly. It all went down on whatever. As the seasons of Growing Up Hip Hop Atlanta carry on, viewers have watched as Bow Wow's wild side becomes the center of discussion. He continues to have relationship drama, even after his explosive encounter with his ex-girlfriend, Kai Moni Leslie, and he's consistently being called out by his party lifestyle, partnered with excessive drinking. The rapper is no stranger to controversy, both on reality television and in his real life. So he had no problem kicking up some dirt by calling R. Kelly's ex-wife, Drea Kelly, a liar. So Bow Wow had a lot of things going on in his life. And of course, you know, he had problems with his ex-girlfriend. Um, he had partnered with excess of drinking. And of course, the rapper is no stranger to controversy. Of course not, because he gets called out all the time. And then here he's got to go kicking up some dirt by calling R. Kelly's ex-wife, Drea Kelly, a liar. Really? I mean, he is, what the heck does he know about what is going on when he wasn't there? And yes, Andrea Kelly does come out with her story. What does she got to lie for? She was there. He was not. On an episode of whatever that word is, Bow and his mother, Teresa Caldwell, are shown having lunch. Mm -hmm. Teresa shares that she had recently met Drea and liked her personally, so she thought it would be nice if Bao met her as well. The rapper laughs and makes it clear that he doesn't want to speak with the ex-Mrs. R. Kelly saying after surviving R. Kelly and that stuff came out. I don't want to be nowhere near that type of energy. So Bao Wow's mother have lunch, Bow Wow and his mother Teresa, they were having lunch together. And of course she met Drea Kelly because you know, she knows what happened with Drea. So she kind of figured her son Bow Wow would meet our, um, Drea Kelly, but he's saying no, he doesn't want to be around her because of him calling her a liar. And it's just pathetic because Andrea Kelly told her story and then he's gonna say oh he's a she's a liar really you don't do that to somebody you don't know when you were not there you don't go and say oh well he's well he's sh he's lying she's lying this and that hey, Bowell needs a lot of growing up to do still but even though he's an adult but still He added, I'm not knocking her. I don't know her to say anything bad about her. But just by watching that documentary, I'm just like, I'm cool. I'm about my brand. I don't want to be associated with pictures with nobody that got anything to do with what's going on with all of that. I'm cool. No surprise pop-ups. None of that. If R. Kelly's ex-wife comes I'm going to ask her about the documentary. I got questions. Then he said with a laugh, 
how much y'all got paid to lie on that man. What? But well, I mean, now he's gonna ask her how much did she get paid to lie on him? She was married to R. Kelly. That well wasn't, unless he became, I don't know, well, a little weirdo. But R. But R. Kelly did bad things to Andrea. That's why she had came out with her story. They was married for a long time until 2009. She filed for divorce because she wasn't going to take it anymore. And then he, Valwell says, I'm not knocking her. I don't know her to say anything bad about her. But just by watching that documentary, I'm just like, he cool. I'm about my, and he about his own brand. Well, if you're about your own brand, then fine. But don't be going around trashing other people. Because, you know, these celebrities are not going to put up with it. And, of course, Andrea Kelly is... I don't know, seems to be a little out of control now, and of course, he's going to be asking her questions, and of course, he, like I said, the one question, he's going to be asking how much y'all got paid to lie on that man. When did Bow Wow ever, Bow Wow is, was not married to R. Kelly, and Drea Kelly was married to R. Kelly. She was there. He wasn't. Bao may be apprehensive about speaking negativity on R. Kelly because the two have previously collaborated together. Kelly and the rapper linked on the song, I'm a Flirt, a track that was featured on Bao's fifth album, The Price of Fame. So... Bow Wow worked with R. Kelly saying I'm a f or the song was called I'm a Flirt. Okay, so you got this hashtag mute R. Kelly movement going. Okay, silence Bow Wow then. Silence everybody else that worked with R. Kelly. Do all that, and then there won't be no controversy between him and, and R. Kelly. And of course, this. Bow Wow may be apprehensive about speaking negativity on R. Kelly. Well, you know what? You should. I mean, oh my gosh. And of course, the two have previously cooperated together, R. Kelly and Bow Wow. So if you're going to mute R. Kelly, mute Bow Wow as well, and mute the other people that have worked with R. Kelly as well take all their songs off too and of course here's the um i do believe it's his um instagram thing and of course he goes by name on instagram shad moss aka hashtag bow well. wasn't there for our mm -hmm. kelly's ex-wife andrea kelly so and of course you know Bow Wow is just accusing Andrea Kelly of lying and he wasn't even there. So he don't know what is going on. So he should not insert himself into somebody business calling somebody a liar because it don't really pertain to him at all. Leave your comments below. I am out.